Hi. What color is this? King. Hey everyone and welcome to another video. I can help but smile today because as you read in the title, today's video is probably one of the most exciting videos that I have ever filmed for my channel. And I honestly feel quite emotional just thinking that this is happening. So, um, so you've read in the title, I have my own collab shade with Victor Polish. <sighs> it is hard to believe that this is finally out there and that I now get to share this news with you. Um, it is crazy. I want to share all the details with you. As usual, I will be swatching all the polishes in this new collection that released by Victor Polish. There is a total of seven shades, including mine, which I'll go in further detail. So, please Please keep watching I'll share with you a little bit of the unboxing when I first received the shade and I'm also going to share the story of what I picked the name that I picked and also why I picked that color and formula please make sure to subscribe to my channel like this video and comment So enough secrets, I am going to share with you first off the name. So you see there we have Selena. Alright, so this is kind of a last minute improvised video that I came up with because this is a very special Ooh. package. Ooh. Yeah. Ooh. So we're going to open it together. Ready? Ready? seat having a collaboration shade with picture polish just because I thought this was more for like big influencers type of thing if you know me and if you follow me you know that I am by no means a big internet personality or anything but I just love the idea of them giving this small opportunity to small accounts like mine so enough said uh, first off the name Selena so you obviously know that I have a daughter and as you can imagine if you have kids my daughter is the center of my world. She, she's everything to me and my husband. Oh my gosh. Um, so these polishes for her. Um, as you might know, I am obsessed with blue nail polishes, but there was something special about me picking a green shade for my collaboration. Uh, first off, I wanted it to be something different than what is already available at Picture Polish, and they have lots of gorgeous blue colors. So I also wanted it to be not only a unique color for the brand, but just something that meant more to me. So Selena recently turned two. And she has had started to say more words lately. One of her favorite words is apple. I think you, that's where, where, where we're coming from with the name, right? So she enjoys, loves apple. She calls everything apple. I feel at some point we were counting one, two, three apple and it was just, it was just a thing. So that is why the polish says she's the apple of my eye because one, she loves the word apple, so I feel like it's really meaningful in that sense. And we even added a little apple there, I hope you can see it. And then also, you already know that phrase, she is the apple of my eye, which pretty much means what I, I've already said about my daughter, that she's pretty much everything to me and my husband, so this was something very special. I uh, love the idea of the name of the polish being Selena because 
you know, it's just something dedicated to her. And besides having all the special memories of a two-year-old in this polished bottle, I also wanted this shade to be something fun for everyone else. So some of you may know summertime is my favorite time of the year and I'm always looking for fun colors to add on my manicures and all the good stuff. So I feel like this green is a good signature for summer. You can obviously wear it any time of the year as I will be doing because I obviously love it. Now one more thing to notice is that this has some hollow in it. So I'll be sharing more details about the formula as I swatch, but I think it's really fun because you know, we all enjoy a good holographic nail polish, a good formula. When I first came up with the idea and I shared these thoughts with Jules, she was reading my mind. I swear that I gave her all my thoughts. I kind of sent her some pictures for reference and I told her uh, what I wanted the formula to look like in a way and she came back to me and she made all of this happen. And she honestly was such an amazing person to work with. So thank you if you're watching Jules, you really made this a reality for me. And I cannot wait to see you guys wearing this polish. If you're able to grab it, that would mean the world to me if you could tag me in your pictures so I can see you wearing Selena. So without further ado, let's get started with the swatches. So here we have a closer look to Selena nail polish. This is described as an apple green scatter hollow and you can perfectly see it here in this clip. We have a lot of hollow going on but that is not the greatest thing about this polish. I mean obviously besides the color, the name and inspiration, the formula is so so good. So please notice here that this was pretty much a one coater for me. I did not apply it as evenly as I would have liked to so I decided to throw on the second coat which I would recommend either way so you can pack that hollow real good on the nail. You can kind of see how it dries up after the first coat so I would strongly suggest for you to apply a top coat as you should do with any other of your manicures so you get that extra glossy look. There we have it, two perfect coats of picture polish Selena. Also, if you happen to get your hands on this polish, please make sure that you use the hashtag and tag me on my Instagram at ByClouser so I can see your swatches or nail art. I would love to see that and repost that too on my stories so we can share with everyone else in the nail community. All right, so I am going to be a little bit biased and say that my polish is my favorite from this release, but I do want to share with you what my second favorite would be. And this is Bolt. This nail polish is just so, so pretty. This is described as a deep cobalt crystal jelly hollow. That's a lot of words, but here you have it. You can totally tell that the finish on this is different. Again, this is more like a jelly finish. So you can see how the opacity was on the first coat. And obviously I just threw on a second one and that gave me perfect coverage. If you had longer nails, you would probably need a third coat, but I think for the most part, two coats is perfectly fine. So here you have it. This polish is so beautiful. It applied so nicely. So I am just thrilled to see that the base color is so cute. And also like that hollow coming throughout under the flashlight looks so beautiful. So in this collection, there is certainly so many cute colors. This one is tulips. And I don't know about you guys, but tulips are my favorite kind of flowers. And this polish is just so accurate to the color. Like it really represents what it is supposed to represent. So I really, really like it. This is described as a coral pink crystal jelly hollow. So the formula is pretty similar to the previous polish that I just swatched. Again, you can tell that the coverage on the first coat was really good, but I certainly needed a second coat just to reach that full opacity. This polish, once again, just like the other ones, applied very, very nicely. I really like the picture polish brush, which I think I have mentioned previously. So here you have it, perfect application. And then here you have this polish under the flashlight. Like you can totally see that hollow. It is so beautiful. Next we have another beautiful holographic polish. This one is NPA and this polish is described as a teal blue scatter hollow. So you can tell here that the application went on super smooth. 
However, this polish did require for me to apply a third coat. And while you watch this swatch, let me tell you a little bit more on how and when you can find these polishes. So these polishes are now available. They are releasing on Monday, July 19th, and you can find them at Picture Polish website. However, depending on where you are in the world, you might want to check out their stockist because they do have a couple of those which you can find on their Instagram under every picture they have listed, the different countries that stockists are located so if you happen to be in the US you can check out this page called color for nails on Instagram and there is just a bunch of other places that uh, you can get stockists which hopefully will be closer to you and would not require for shipping to be so costly obviously if you buy through picture polish you could get free shipping but you do have to reach certain amount for it so just keep that in mind there's just some info about shipping information all right, this next color for some reason just makes me so happy. This is such a happy color and I might pronounce it wrong, but the name of this, I believe it's Rani. And this one is described as a Ravi Pink Crystal Jelly Hollow. So this polish is just so, so beautiful. I love pink polishes a lot, but I do not feel like I have many in tones like this one. So it's always really exciting when I get some polishes that are pretty unique to my collection because you know, they simply hold a special place among the other ones that I already have. So here you have this one, perfect opacity on two coats. And here is how it looks under the flashlight. Please let me know in the comments if you're still watching. I know this video is pretty long. Which one is your favorite polish so far? And what are you thinking of the formula so far? So the next polish is something so, so pretty. I mentioned this on my Instagram. I think this one is very unique and the coverage on this polish is just unreal. This is probably one of those that could easily be a one coater for me, but this one is described as a pewter scatter hollow. I am saying that wrong, I'm pretty sure, but I'll write it down here. So there you have it. I did apply two coats on this one. I would say that this one sits somewhere in between white and gray. So I guess it will depend a lot on your skin tone on how this one would look, but I really, really like it on me. You can totally check out the different complexion swatchers on Picture Polish Instagram and also on their website so you can see or get an idea on how this polish would look on you. So this is a very, very lovely color. Oh, I can't believe this is the last swatch that I'll be sharing with you, but this polish is also one of my favorite ones. This is Be Creative and it's described as an Irish crystal jelly hollow. So you can tell on this one that this is more of a jelly formula and it does remind me a lot to the blue polish that I swatched at the very beginning. So certainly I would think you would need about two, three coats to reach out full opacity depending on the length of your nails. I do want to say a little bit more about picture polish before we end this video and I keep talking more. That picture polish is a vegan brand and they do not do any animal testing. They are also transitioning most of their polishes to a plant-based formula, which we have seen on their latest releases, which is honestly awesome. And they are also transitioning to a flat rounded brush, which I think most of us love. I, I think the application on this is just so much easier that way. So I'm a big fan of that. So once again, let me know in the comments which one was your favorite. And just a friendly reminder, if you purchase Selena, please don't forget to tag me on your Instagram, Facebook, or wherever you post your nail art. I'll be so, so happy to see your swatches, your nail art, your thoughts about um, the polish itself, because I am honestly so excited and curious for you to have it and try it. All right, so that is it from me today. I really hope that you enjoyed this video. Please make sure to check out Picture Polish website to purchase or check out their Instagram for more info on how to get shipping. From my part, I do want to say a huge thanks to all of you who follow me, who are subscribed to my channel, who appreciate my art, because honestly, all of this is happening thanks to you because you appreciate um, the things that I share with you and that just means a lot from a small content creator it means a lot so also huge thanks to picture polish 
for making this dream come true. I mean, it is crazy because I never in a million years would have thought that I would have my own collaboration shade with Picture Polish and now it's here. So I am honestly so excited to see you guys uh, wearing this polish and any other polish in this collection. Also make sure to check out all the other creators that created their own polishes in this new release. For my part, I just want to say thanks to everyone, thanks Picture Polish and thank you for watching. Please don't forget to like this video, give it a big thumbs up, don't forget to subscribe and I will see you on the next one. Goodbye!